Welcome again everybody to a new video uh, and in this series of videos we are discussing the radiographic appearance of restorative materials. Uh, in this periapical radiograph you will see that there is a different number of uh, a different number of uh, materials that are used uh, to uh, restore teeth and we will start from the upper seven the most posterior tooth and this tooth you will see that there is a class one uh, composite filling uh, the composite filling if you compare it to the other fillings or restorative materials which are closer to it uh, it appears uh, appears less radio opaque uh, than the uh, uh, than the other metallic restorations, and this is the class one composite restoration. Okay, uh, if you compare it to the MOD amalgam filling, you will see that the radio opacity is much more uh, 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 in the amalgam filling and you can see that the amalgam is extending from the mesial surface of the upper six to the distal surface and underneath the distal uh, uh, filling box of the filling uh, uh, you will see a material that has a lesser radio opacity than the amalgam filling and this is the lining material uh, zinc, phosphate, uh, zinc phosphate cement which is used here you can't see it in the other parts as we said in the previous videos, this could be either to superimposition or resorption of the, materi uh, resorption of the material or uh, the, uh, the thin layer of the uh, liner which is used. Anyway, what we can see here is the uh, lining material which is used in the box of the distal cavity. If we go to the other tooth, which is a root canal filled tooth, we will see that this tooth has been restored by a PFM that is porcelain infused to metal and this is the porcelain part which has a, a lesser radio opacity if you compare it to the uh, metal core and this is the core of the uh, of the crown okay see that the core of the crown the metal core of the crown has a lesser radio opacity than amalgam and this is expected because the thickness of the material which is used in the core is less than the uh, uh, <coughs> than that of amalgam and of course that amalgam is a denser material uh, because uh, because of its components so it will appear more radiopic if we go uh, and see the root of the uh, tooth we will see that it is filled with gutta perca gutta perca uh, 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 if you compare it to all of these materials of course it has the uh, least radio opacity because of the uh, uh, its <coughs> components now the upper four which is uh, also root canal filled we will see that there is a composite film th a filling that which is used in the coronal part of the tooth and the composite filling uh, you can see here that there is a root canal filling get a perca and if you concentrate on the uh, uh, the palatal root if you concentrate on the palatal root you will see that there is a material which has a uh, more radio opacity than the surrounding uh, or the rest of the filling material now, if we concentrate on the shape of this uh, the material and its the opacity, we will see that, and of course, the, uh, it has not reached to the apex, we will uh, 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 conclude that this is a broken uh, file uh, uh, or instrument, and I don't think, uh, uh, instrument that has been broken and apparently that there was an attempt to take it out but it, wa it was difficult so it was left in place uh, if you compare with the, the radio opacity of the material and the shape then we will uh, 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 we will assume that this is a broken instrument 
uh, that this is a broken endodontic file or a remo that has been left in place and uh, uh, it's not been uh, recovered or it's not been taken out. So composite, get a poker, uh, metal, uh, sta uh, 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 broken uh, file or a remo, PFM, get a poker, amalgam, cement, zinc phosphate cement and composite.